Hey guys, Hayden here. So you're about to watch my live reaction to the Super Smash Brothers Ultimate Direct. Um, I am aware that there was a bit of a leak last night. Um, I didn't see it. I'm not going to check it. I'm going into this completely spoiler free. I have no idea what was revealed. All I know that it was maybe hinting towards a character or something. I don't know, but what you're about to see is completely spoiler free. So enjoy. Start recording. Let's full screen this. And we are good to go, people. The Super Smash Brothers Ultimate Direct is happening in less than a minute. I am so unbelievably excited. I'm sure everyone is. Um, I'm so happy that this worked into my work schedule as well. I've got about four hours free in between when I had to work in the morning and when I had to work in the afternoon. So this is really, really good for me. I'm really pumped this worked out. Let's see what you got, Sakurai. I am just so... Oh, anything Smash Brothers. I, the, Nintendo knows Smash Brothers is their golden goose. That's what gets people hyped. Oh, this is going to be good. I can just feel it. Here we go. Oh, are we starting with a character? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's this Simon Belmont. Is this Simon Belmont? Oh, no, wait. Is this... What the? Is this Simon Belmont? There's zombies. They're in a castle. It's Luigi. I love the Luigi's Mansion tie-in with the scary... Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wait a second. What is this? What am I what? Oh! oh my god! Oh my god! That was right! It is Simon! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god, Simon! music he's got the throwing axe oh oh my god castlevania is in super smash brothers oh my god look at the stage oh my god <laughs> and he walks just like he does in like the old castlevanias dracula Oh my god! This is incredible! I can't! Be gone. You don't belong in this world. Wait! Richter! Oh, is he, a, is he an Echo Fighter? Oh my god, Richter and Simon! Is he playing differently? Wait! Alucard! I just saw Alucard there! We're getting all sorts of Castlevania. Oh my god! Are you kidding me? Holy crap! So that leak from a while ago was real. Oh my dear lord. Nintendo Sakurai. Konnichiwa. Hello. I'm Masahiro Sakurai. From Sword Sakurai, you this are a god. This is announcements about Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. Without further ado, this music. Oh my god. The legendary vampire hunter from the Castlevania series, Simon Belmont. Oh my god. Okay. Joining the roster. He's been given a bit of a makeover. His signature item is, of course, his holy whip. Oh my god. Vampire. He looks like so much fun. It leaves you open to attack, and it's a bit slow, but I think its average reach during normal attacks is longer than any other fighters. Nice. He can move the whip freely. Yeah, just like in Castlevania 4. Yeah, he can do the whole, like, his all over the place. are very recognizable. 
the axe. Yep. <clears throat> Cross. Oh yeah. Holy water. Holy water, yep. Down B. And upper. Nice. While they may seem simple, they are very powerful. Oh my and god. This final smash is called Grand Cross. Is this the timeline that we're in where Simon Belmont is in Super Smash Brothers? Dracula's Castle. Simon's stage is none other than Dracula's Castle. It's the darkest of stages in Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. Oh my god, yo! When an attack hits one of the candlesticks, an item mode. Nice, okay, yep, makes sense. In this stage, bosses from across the Castlevania series will rear their ugly heads. They make Dracula's castle feel true to the world from whence they Yo! Were. Yeah, I saw death and I was like, wait, what is, is this actually... Oh my god. And, when speaking of Castlevania, you can't forget to mention the music. Yeah! On this stage, we will incorporate 34 music tracks. Whoa! And classic tunes. The 34! Is very popular among our music team, and they were excited to work on these arrangements. Oh my god! On the blue moon, Simon's mortal rival will appear. Dracula. What does he do? Dracula. Hopefully he's For not like the Yellow Devil. Years, he is eternally fated to wage war against descendants of the Belmont clan. Oh, he's got the fireballs, yep. Under what conditions will he appear? Time will tell. Oh, man. Now, for a brand new assist trophy. Was it Alucard? Yeah, Alucard, yeah. Alucard, That's amazing. The son of Dracula will lend his steel in battle. He wields the chrysogram, transforms into a bat, and dodges attacks by assuming mist form. Oh my god! This Symphony of the Night remix! Role in Castlevania, Symphony of the Night. Oh, like oh, oh, oh. Trophies, he's susceptible to attack and KO as well. Nevertheless, you will prove to be quite challenging. Holy crap. And we have one more fighter for you. Oh my god. The Vampire Hunter. Richter. Classics like Castlevania Rondo of Blood. Richter Belmont joins the battle. Richter is an echo fighter yeah. based on Simon. Cool. Though his strength is the same, his look, voice, and animations all set him apart. Besides, right the Super on. Smash Brothers Ultimate version of Simon can perform moves derived from Richter in his original games, so it's hard to say who's really echoing who. I hope that's true. Them both. Farewell. Oh my god. I'd like to introduce two more Echo Fighters from completely different series. Two more Echo Fighters! Please take a look. I knew we'd be getting a fair amount, just because why would they introduce it without that? Without actually going all in. More Fire Emblem! Yay! Krom! He got his chance! Yay! <laughs> I don't know. I don't really care that much about Fire Emblem. But I mean, hey, this is going to definitely satisfy some people. And he did say, he did get that tease in the last game where he's like, I guess I'll get my chance another day, so. So he's got a different final smash, it seems like, but he's, I guess, Lucina's? So we got like three versions of Marth now. Dark Samus, nice! Oh, nice! That one is hype! So yeah, they're not an assist trophy anymore. Man, we're we got two new Metroid characters now, even though one's a Neko Fighter. This is hype! Damn, how big is this roster now? Krom and Dark Samus joined the battle. You may have seen this coming. Both fighters have been <laughs> highly requested. He knows, he knows. They're each slightly different than the fighters they're based on. So oh, so wait, Krom was Ike. I don't know Fire Emblem that well, sorry. As you can see, depending on your settings, you can either display all Echo Fighters separately on the Fighter Select screen or stack them with the fighters they're based on. Oh, cool! When stacked, you can switch between them with the press of a button. <sighs> Man, Sakurai is just going all in with the details. I love it. 
This time, we plan to reveal the design of every fighter before the game launches. We'll have okay. The announced later, so stay tuned. So there's still a few more. All right, there's still a few more. For stages, we're mainly including returning favorites. Allow me to introduce some of the stages we haven't shown before. Pokemon Stadium 1. Oh my god. I think we saw this, but like, so good that it's back. It's way better than Stadium 2. Garden of Hope. Show Fountain of Dreams. Brinstark Depths! Oh, nice. Look at Kraid. Oh, I'm so happy this one's back. I know it's not competitively viable, but I love this stage. Oh my god, Summit. The Unova Pokemon League. I think we also saw this one. I want to see Spear Pillar, though. What's going to happen with Palkia? Because he's a Pokeball Pokemon. Oh, Magicant in HD. Hopefully they tone the Flying Men down a little bit. There's Final Destination, finally. Yo, look at this. So that leaked picture, or not leaked, but that picture with Fox in it was right. There it is, New Dog City. New Dog City Hall. Oh, and you're gonna go up the tower, okay. So it's kind of like Prison Tower. No, this song, it's a remix. There's Pauline. In the air. Oh, I just sang it wrong, but there's the music. Oh, God, this game. We put a lot there. Of effort into enhancing the look Fountain of Dreams, there it is. As well. He knew this was a popular one, too. That said, for stages that originally appeared in the Nintendo 64 game, we prioritized nostalgia, intentionally keeping the classic. Nice. The stage total is turning out to be pretty impressive. Let's compare it to the totals in previous games. Oh man, are they gonna give us a number? Now the total number of stages is voila, 103. Oh, 103. If we exclude Battlefield, Final Destination, and Big Battlefield, we'd have exactly 100. But take a look at the stage select screen. Every stage <laughs> can be <laughs> Battlefield and Omega form, so the total number of stages is actually... Oh my frig! All of these stages can be played in 8-player battle. Every and stage for 8-player battle! The and they're all available from the beginning! Additionally, you have the option to turn off stage hazards. Oh, oh my god! For a change of pace and don't there it is! Be interrupted by hazards. Select this option for a less chaotic experience. I think we knew this already, but we're actually seeing it now. Also, the order of the stages matches the order in which they were introduced in the series, just like the fighters. <laughs> Holy crap! I can't Regarding take this! Regarding stages, we have a little surprise. Please take a look. A little surprise? Oh my god. Wait. Wait, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Check that out. While a playing, changing the stage can transform around you. This is a new mode. But first, you must select stage, stage morph. Then what? You can pick two stages on the stage select menu. What the hell? Any stages you like and have fun. This is amazing. Oh my god, there's the Paper Mario stage. For the player who wants it all, my music lets you select specific oh my god. Each stage, and this feature is making a return. Oh my god. This Until is the now, best game of all had time. Its own set of music tracks. But this time, the tracks are organized by series instead. For example, as long as you're playing on a stage based on the Legend of Zelda series, you can pick any of the tracks included from that series. Now for the total number of music tracks from stages. Oh my god, this Sakurai. Is also ultimate. Sakurai.
<laughs> oh, oh my god! Oh my god! There's more than 800! He stopped music, and it kept like going! Menus and fanfare, then there's actually about 900 compositions. 900! So them all in a row, without looping or stopping. There's more than 28 hours Oh my god. Music. My heart. These game franchises oh. are a big part of video game history, and the result is a massive oh my god. Of memorable music. All of this packed into one game. This, in itself, is extraordinary. Of course, there's a sound test menu as well. For your browsing pleasure, we've sorted all of the tracks by oh game Oh my god. Series. It's like having an album for each series. I... I, if a track has no I can't. Fighter or stage, or if it's from oh one my god. One series, it can be found in the other Every series. one of my dreams is coming true. You can create your own playlist too. I gotta sort them in any order. I gotta calm like, down. Anytime, as much Workout, as bedtime, Friday feeling. You can just listen to this on the go. Every, the best Nintendo soundtrack. In handheld mode, you can play music while the screen is turned off. It's kind of like using your Nintendo Switch as a music player. A huge variety of music has been collected for the game, and you can sample oh some of these tracks god. on the official website. Oh my god. We're planning to add selections basically every week, so please stay tuned. Yeah, I was going to say, they've been doing that already. It's amazing. Rules. Some of you may have experienced the game already, but I'd still like to show you some things about the multiplayer battle rules. Now the first thing you will select is the rules. If you create oh, your own good. Rule set, you can immediately begin playing with those rules at any time. I like that, because it's always annoying having to change it while everyone's trying to choose their characters. In addition to time battle and stock battle, stamina battle is now treated as one of the standard Smash modes. Cool! There's a different feeling of intensity in these battles. I never really played stamina, but that's cool. This time, stage selection comes before fighter selection. This way, you can pick a fighter yeah. based on how well suited they are for the stage. I like that stage. I like or that change a lot too. Last battle's loser pick the next stage to even the odds. In sudden death, you not only start with 300% damage, but the camera will steadily. Whoa! Spin. This creates a nice sense of urgency. I like this. Chargeable final smashes are now a selectable option. Really? During a match, your final smash meter will fill, and then once really you use a weaker final smash. They're going straight fighting game on this. Whoa! When you apply this option to a match, things can get really flashy. If you're up for a they want to make final smashes legal. By the way, no two final smashes will happen simultaneously. Wow. There are other additions to the battle modes, too. Squad Strike! Is this co- added in Yo! Squad strike. D different characters! 5 on 5 or 3 on 3 elimination style battle. And you switch your characters when you die! Each player will use 5 consecutive- Yes! Battle, but it might be fun for multiple Thank players you. to take turns as well. They salvaged this from Smash Tour! Oh! We're also thank you, Sakurai! Sakurai. Choose the number of players in CPU He's making all the, the right decisions. There's not a single strategy. thing wrong with this game. Up to 32 players can join the tournament, so it's great for parties too. Smashdown. We're adding a special Smash mode called Smashdown. After a battle in this mode, the previously selected fighters will no longer be available to use in the next battle, so each player must select a different Ooh. fighter. It definitely pays off to be skilled with multiple fighters. You could also strategically pick a fighter your opponent is good with. Oh, my ear can. itches. <laughs> the new training mode will feature an exclusive stage. We've displayed a grid so it's easy to measure distance and more. You can oh, also display cool. launch distance. Yo, what? The red line predicts your trajectory at 0% damage and the blue line is for 100% damage. The fighter's weight is factored in at the moment of impact. Sakurai, I love you. 
Classic mode, okay. The single player mode in which players battle against a series of fighters will return in the form of classic mode. Nice. Got the mushroom on his head. <laughs> Each fighter looks like a, the earthbound mushroom as well. Opponents they will face. This is the best game ever. Now, let me introduce you to some new items, Pokemon and Assist Trophies. Oh man. So yeah, the banana I think it's like a banana gun, right? <laughs> I don't know. Oh my god. I love this song too, the bonus theme. We heard this in Diddy's like little intro trailer. Whoa. Death Scythe, all oh, from uh, Castlevania, of course. This music. Yeah, the Ramblin' Evil Mushroom. Yeah, I think we saw this in a, um, in a picture. Oh my god, this music! Yo! I'm not even paying attention to the items. This music! What do we got for Pokemon? Alolan Executor! <laughs> you had to include him! This song! Yo, the Sun and Moon battle theme! Yeah, okay, so we saw Abra at E3. Solgaleo, yep. Sunsteel Strike is like, what it uses, yeah. Lunala. Moongeist Beam. Mimikyu, yep, he had to be in. Oh, and he does the, uh, he does that in the anime, where it, I think it's Play Rough. Kyuku Muku. Yeah, I was gonna say, it would probably, like, encounter you or something. <laughs> and it waves goodbye. So we got both Vulpixes in here. Nice. Marshadow. Very nice. Ditto. Yo! Oh, that's amazing. I'm kind of surprised. Back to base. Zero! He's an assist trophy. Yo, Zero's in here. Can Mega Man X be a character, please? This song! It's the Mega Man X intro stage! They're including Mega Man X music. We already saw Crystal at zero. Oh my god. A claptrap from Donkey Kong. Show me King K. Rule! Claptrap is in here. Show me King K. Rule as a character. Chef Kawasaki. Nice. I always liked um, Kirby's Final Smash better when it was the Chef one. Gray Fox. Very nice. Metal Gear Solid. Nikki. <laughs> Shovel Knight! He's an assist trophy, guys. He's not a character. But Shovel Knight is in here. Yo! The moon from Majora's Mask! Oh my fuck! Shovel Knight's not a character. Can be considered special guest and another powerful Ashley is an assist trophy. Arrived. A powerful special guest? Is this Monster Hunter? Yeah, I think this is Monster Hunter. From the Monster Hunter. Yeah. Series, Rathalos swoops in. Is it? This is a Monster Hunter stage. He appears as a boss. As a boss. But he can also show up as an assist trophy. Really? Actually, he's the first character to appear as both. He's enormous. Before we go. 
Before we go, I'd like us to take a quick look at the main menu. Okay. Is he fixing it? Is it like good menus? He's got something blurred out there. As you yeah. can see, there's a mysterious mode. Games here, and more. But we can't talk about that just yet. Also, there's a dashboard on the right side of the screen. This can be accessed at any time by pressing the ZR button. Options and control descriptions are listed here as well. Okay. Guys, oh my god. So that's all for today's announcement. The entire development team is putting all of their energy into finishing the game, so please be patient until yeah, it's rumbling. What's going on here? Thank you so much for watching. Yeah, what's going on here? What's going on? Not actual gameplay footage. Don't tell me this is King K. Rule. Do not tell me. No. Oh my God. This is my character. Don't tell me this is King K. Rule. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh. What the? King DDD is trolling. There he is! King K. Rool comes aboard! Oh my god! Oh my god! This is my character! This is my... Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god. He's real! He's in the game. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! I... I can't! King K. Rool is... is in the game! Oh my god! Oh my god. Oh my god. Simon's there. Richter's there. Krom. Dark Samus. King K. I can't even speak. I can't even speak. Wow. Wow.